Okay. Hello? Well, I'm happy to say that I finally got my jars. Not only that, holy stinky. I stocked up so, like, oh man, I got more than enough jars. Because I have no fucking idea how much of this hot sauce I'm going to be making. All I know is I'm going to be making a whole bunch of it. It's because I can add some spices and I gotta get it right. I don't know if I'm gonna get it right the first time. So here goes nothing. But until then, what I'm thinking, I got my jars. I got my supplies. Now, why did it take me so long to get these jars? Well, it's not because I'm always original and solid, because I'm always fresh. It's because I knew deep down inside I wasn't going to be able to control myself. And sure enough, I wasn't able to control myself. And guess what I did? Yep, I went out and I got me myself a bunch more supplies. But, what were the supplies for? Oh no, 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 no. Not for my hot sauce. Oh no, all those bases have been long covered. Oh man. And I threw in a whole bunch of extras that I just don't need, just in case. Why? Who knows? Just in case, it might make the hot sauce. Oh my god. But that's beside the point. What are all these extra supplies for? Well, some of the supplies, I guess, to keep me going. Oh yeah, I always gotta have those. What's the other supplies? I needed some practice supplies for my bomb brownies, okay? I have finally, 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 after years of making brownies, okay? I found out the secret on how to make them extra Fuji. And when I mean Fuji, I'm talking about on the inside. So like when you take that bite, you're like, oh my gosh, it's so chocolatey, but no, no, no. You have no clue what you're in for. Cause it's gotta be so fudge. It's gonna be fudge-tacular. Cause I already mastered cutting the cheese. Oh, please, don't even get me started. Which reminds me, while I was getting supplies, I actually paid for everything. And that's when I realized I forgot my cheese. So I had to go back and get some more. Ooh, can never run out of the cheese. It's kind of big in my business. But anyways, back to what my story. Yes. I finally, after doing so much research, and after epically failing on my first attempt, Which is why, for my next attempts, I'm not even gonna take it to the box. Oh no, this time I'm making it oh so personal. Because I did the research, and damn it, it was such a forking rookie mistake on what I did. And it was all because I was just so excited because it's been so long, so long. It's been years since I've made brownies. So now, I'm gonna make them from scratch. Why? Because they're, it's not, it's not that fucking hard. It's not that fucking hard. All it takes is the effort. 
and damn it. Ugh, I've just been so afraid of food in the past. And now, today, I'm not afraid to attack it. I'm afraid of what I'm gonna do to it. Now, if I can only get it inside my mouth. Mm. That's another story. But, happy to say, I have got more than enough space to make more than enough salt, hot sauce and other things that I might think of. Um, oh my God. This is good because the more sauce that I make, the more jars that I can divvy them up to, and then the more attempts at spices I can try. Because, like, I'm kind of, like, okay, I don't want to say that I know what I'm doing. I'll tell you exactly what I'm doing. I'm having the time of my forking life. But I will say one thing. I've made enough mistakes in the past to know what I have to do. Holy stinky. I just realized there are a whole bunch of steps that I forgot to put on the list. So I have to cut this recording short and I gotta get back to my list because, oh man, I'm telling you, there is no way in hell that I'm even gonna get started until I have all of these blueprints locked down. I mean locked down. I'm not gonna miss anything because I gotta make sure from Alpha to Zeta, Zeta, Alpha, Beta Congo, Jumanji, and everything I've got to mention, okay? This is gonna be forking huge. This is gonna be forking huge. This is kind of a big deal, all right? I mean it. I mean it, okay? Like, I didn't know that I could make a hot sauce. And then I found out I could make a hot sauce. And then I pushed the envelope just a little to see what I could do. And I, I was like, oh my God. I could do a lot. I could do a lot. And it's not all in my head. And sure, I'm biased because, yeah, I'm the one making it. But no, I'm getting other people's opinions. And other people are dying to wait and see what I can come up with. Okay? And, oh, man. And I've been trying to get everybody to try this. And I've been asking people at the most inopportune times. And some of them, a lot of them, have only been getting a sniff test. But you know what? I can honestly say that it's passed the sniff test with flying colors. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And the taste test, flying colors. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The one complaint, it's too spicy. But that's it. So, oh yeah, I know what I have to do, and I know how to do it because I've already done my research. And now, and I, it's just this one spice. It's this one spice, and it's also nice. Everybody loves it, unless you're allergic to it or you just can't eat it because it's bad for you. But everybody loves it, okay? You should get. You should know what it is. Come on, come on. Anyways, 
That's all I need to add. And it will make things oh so sweeter. It will make things oh so less spicy. It will take care of my problem. But it's the easy way out. And that's why I don't want to do it. I want to make this as hard on me as possible. <sighs> but you know what? I'm only going to push myself as far as I can. I'm only human. And I know that, you know, like, oh, I'm losing my fucking mind. <sighs> okay. All right. What I have to do now, I have to get all of the steps down because I missed a whole bunch of fucking steps. Oh my god. And I realize that now since I finally have all of my necessary jars. I'm a little scared now. But it's okay. Because when I'm thinking, thinking, I wish I had a bigger blunder, but it's okay, because you know what? Oh my God. No, I, oh man. Now I'm thinking, oh man, oh man. I'm just eating my own words. Why not go big? Now I gotta see how much I got. Oh man. And you know what? There's still time to go shopping. Cause I'm always fresh. And I'm always original. <gasps> oh my god, that's so smart. I'm so smart. I'm gonna go big. I'm gonna go big. I'm gonna go really big. Yeah. I'm going big. Not making my head so big. Why? Because all the thoughts are racing through my head right now. Oh, it's so it's such a good thing that you can't see what's going on up here. Because it's a disaster. Oh man. I am a magic mushroom. And now this is how you can see me. Do, 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 do. You see, when I pull out my magic mushroom, all the magic stuff happens. Oh, this is gonna be so amazing. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, I'm back. You see, this is why. This is why. Slow and steady wins the race. And I don't know why I do stuff, but I know. That if I'm do, I'm doing it for a reason, and it's because I need more time to think. Because oh my God, it's so hard for me to like have a clear and concise and focused thought. And if you can pay attention to my video so earlier, oh man, I was so excited. I was gonna go hunting for some supplies, for another project, which is something, oh my god, okay, oh man, all right, like, this was something that popped into my head before the hot sauce, but then it was like a fart in the wind, and I really didn't, like, show it the respect that it deserved, okay? I can honestly say that. And, you know, uh, now I'm really looking up to you because I have high aspirations, I have high dreams. And you know what? I'm staying focused, okay? Now, as I was saying, I almost got sidetracked. I almost got sidetracked because, oh my gosh. There's a fucking sale going on right now. And, oh my god. You know, there's this fucking sale. And, I, oh my god. 
I'm gonna be saving a whole bunch of money because this is gonna be my first time purchase. And I got a few other tricks up my sleeve that I've been saving for the right moment. Because you know, some things, uh, but it's okay. Because you know, I think I might still have time for this. I might still have time for this. So if I can't, I can't hold, you know, I don't have one of those holders and my arm gets tired. I've been walking around and I've been hunting and then I've been forgetting and I've been thinking and, and I haven't mentioned before, I suffer from hyper thoughts. So like, you know, oh. Where you can have like one or two or maybe 20 or 30 things running through your head. I have like... A whole lot more. It's overwhelming. And sometimes I lose my breath. And I have to take the time. To catch myself. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. So, yeah. I have the shakes. Okay. I do my best to try and hold them. But that was just a small example. And that was just in my hands. You can't imagine what goes on in my legs. Oh my holy stinky. Hold on. I'm gonna take a moment to get some fresh air. Hey, you!